There it is. Miner's camp. Could find some clues. Could find some loot. I'll leave the loot though. <laughs> leave the loot and do my job. We got footprints. Footprints. Human. Oh, stop. I hate it when it does that. I think it's my I think it's a control yeah, thing. Vein, but something went wrong. So they did find some they did find some silver after all that. Let's follow these footprints. Looks like we've got white wolves ahead. Reckon the wolves killed him? What now, you piece of hell? Ah. Well, man, that is things that are attacking in packs. take their pelts, so I think white wolf pelts suffer quite a bit. Mind you, all we're getting is the damn livers. Not interested in your livers. Now, where was that body? Wounds caused by a blunt instrument. Rib cage smashed in. That doesn't sound to me like... Uh... Wolves? Someone crawled through here with a broken leg. The broken leg? How the hell do you know that? <clears throat> okay, so what we'll do is we should sip on some water. So hit with a blunt instrument. Um, something big felled the trees. Can't be another cyclops, can it? You reckon? What else carries a big club? Big creature. Crushed bones. Human bones. A rock troll looks Trolls. like. Hmm. Well, these things are a pain as well, aren't they? Whamma wham! <laughs> Let's have a look at the entry. Whamma wham! Rock trolls come across as dim witted, ponderous, slow, stupid, to be frank. It's easy to dismiss them and even easier to enrage them. When this happens, one's best bet is to run as fast as possible for an angered rock troll is as deadly as a thundering landslide. The truth held in the case of the massive rock troll known as Wamalam is every blow struck like a battery ram, meaning one needed either avoid them entirely or protect oneself with a quen sign. Its hard skin meant it was near invulnerable to sword strikes, especially from those dealt from behind, where its rock armour is the thickest. The only hope for defeating it in taking advantage of its typical troll slowness, especially if further exploited using the Yirden sign. 
Right, well, we're going to get ourselves prepared now. Because I don't think there's going to be any talking to this thing. Uh, Ogroid oil. For a troll. So many damn oils. Right, so Ogroid oil. Got the Thunderbolt. Got the Tawny Owl. Still got a decent amount of use for my Swallow and Thing potions here. <coughs> Yurden sign. Quen sign. Get the Quen sign on now. There he is, look. It's quite a big cave in here as well. I want to look around some first. There's the other miner. Dead. Just dead. Just, oh, which, maybe not the other miners. There's more than one body here. Those are all the miners. Dead. Just dead. Just very, very Extensive dead. bruising and abrasions. Broken bones. Yep. Another dead. What's this? Silver vein. What they came for. What they died for. Are we, uh... Silver vein. What they came for. What they died for. I'm gonna say, can we grab a bit? <laughs> Would it be in bad taste to uh, take some... Actually, it'd be... we could take some back to the village and say, well, here you go, the monster is slain, your miners are dead, unfortunately, but here you go, here's some... Here's some silver. Mind you, I suppose if we kill the rock troll, they'll be safe to come back, won't they? And mine it themselves. With a new batch of miners, if there's any left in the village. Okay, so here's white. It's a bit murky in here. Might use my cat potion first. Come on! Oh, 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 oh! Keep away from his wham wham Stop it. I want to talk. Oh, we can actually talk with him. I think we're going to have to get him down to a certain amount of energy first. Wait, I want to talk. Talk? Talk? But you can't. Oh. Call you wham a wham like this. Exactly. Why do you wham em? Things in walk troll house. Troll say out mans, but they wham a wham troll rocks. So troll wham too. Ah. So they attacked him first. That's an interesting concept. Ugh. Won't get away with this. Or I'll let this slide. They were asking for it. I mean, I wouldn't say they were asking for it. Maybe they panicked and just attacked it. But if he was defending himself and this is his house, you know, if somebody came into my house and started swinging, well, they'll get whammer whammed as well. <laughs> and I don't think trolls are clever enough to start pulling the wool over my eyes. So I'm going to believe him. And I'm going to let it slide. From what you say, they were asking for trouble. I'll let it slide, this time. But kill any other humans, and I'll come back and cut off your head. Understand? No. Words are words many. Hurt head. Let me try again. wham a wham mans again. I'll swish a swash a swunk you. <laughs> oh, no more troll wham. And this man take for be good man and no swisher swash. Swisher swash. <laughs> okay, wham oh wham. I'll be seeing you after I just checked out some chests here. You don't mind if I loot and plunder, do you, wham oh wham? I did spare you after all. Right. Okay, Wham Wham. It's been a pleasure talking. See you later. <laughs> Is that deer in the entrance? Three of them, in fact. I think that's reasonable, don't you? Even if they are humans, and humans can be, well, you know what I mean. They can be very, very, uh, well, nasty when they want to be. 
Uh, they walk into a troll's house. They start swinging their axes, their blades, whatever their pickaxe, whatever they've got. They start attacking the thing, and he defended himself. I mean, it's reasonable for him to to give him a bit of a whamming. So uh, we're supposed to return to the uh, village to tell the elder what happened, and to tell him not to send any more people to the mm, silver mm, cave mine, whatever it is, because well, it's. Uh, it belongs to a troll. Sorry about that. Well, I'm trying to do something here. I'm getting confused. Uh, white honey. That's the one. Roach! God damn it. Roach! Why can't I summon my horse? Is he dead? Oh! Blooming it. There you are! Where the hell did it get to? Let's go! Thought I was gonna have to use my bloody own two feet here. Okay, so here we are. Back at the uh, elder's house. Very, very strange Snow now. house. There he is. You and the king, when the weir bears a tie. Greetings, Watcher. Your miners are dead. Not one of you knew a troll lived there. We'd heard mention of it, but... But greed went out over reason. Not your place to judge us. What about the troll? The troll is alive! Peace, advise you to do the same. <laughs> Turn curd, you mean? What kind of monster slayer are you? Out of my sight! So we get no cash from him. Uh, that one. Oh, we get, well, we do get 50 crowns. Is it just me or all these village elders? Well, not say all of them. The majority of these village elders are they completely and utterly clueless? The one in the village not so long ago who bloody give us half our reward because it wasn't actually a dragon we slew but a fork tail, and now this one because we actually left the cave troll in peace. Of course, we don't kill sentient monsters unless there's a reason to. Uh, calling us a coward. I mean. Sometimes you just want to get them by the hair and give them a good slap. That's the violent side of me coming out. <laughs> slap some sense into them, you know? Slow now. Greedy son of a... <sighs> anyway, take a deep breath. Take a deep breath. And we shall move on. Okay, now uh, we're going to go back to the practicum in Advanced Alchemy because there is another piece of the puzzle that I'm going to move my way towards, and it's actually... Uh, oh, there's two of them. There's one here and there's one there. I was working my way down this way, or was I working my way down that way? I don't know. No, I wasn't working my way down that way at all. I was going to work my way... <laughs> I, did say, I did say at the start this was going to be a very fragmented sort of session in some regards, but I did have a plan did have a plan so bear with me it will it will take shape it will take shape I've been distracted because I've got other quests hallowed horn that was the one hallowed horn hard times deliver the letter to the smith at Ketchup. okay so hard times that we picked up a stolen horn from somewhere can't remember where but we, was it in the uh, whale graveyard Anyway, we picked up a, whatever we picked up, a horn, and it's all the way down here. Now, I can't believe, don't believe we've been to Holmstein's port just yet. So this will be a new location for us. There is actually a notice board here as well, but on the way to this place, there's several undiscovered locations. So my plan was, we'll stop off, we might leave that one, we'll stop off here, here, and here. Down here there is another quest. It's just coming back to me now. For missing son. 
And uh, so what we'll do is we'll, we'll 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 stop off here, pick up this or develop this Witcher contract, see where the missing sun is, see if it's on the way or see if it's nearby. And then we'll make our way down through a, a couple of undiscovered locations there, a couple of undiscovered locations there, and end up here where the horn is. Return the horn, pick up the notice board, and then we're going to pick up some quests down here, I think, as well. And that might well take us to the end of the session. My plan after reaching Holmstein's port and finishing up down here was then to reverse our path back up this way. And we might actually fast travel. Because so at the grotto here, there was a piece of the enhanced griffin armor set. And now we've picked up that other quest regarding those brothers, which is near here as well. So, whew, it's just all over the place, isn't it? But this is what I love about the game. I've said it before and I, I, I'll, I'll keep repeating it. Uh, it's, it's just the sense of, of busyness. You know, you're never wanting for things to do. And the things that you do do... Very, very rarely are they ever dull. The side quests develop into interesting things. You have to make uh, decisions nearly in every one of them that tear at your moral choices. Uh, you, you, you're travelling to new areas of, of the land, looking at the scenery, enjoying the scenery. It's Snow just now. Whoa. It's just great stuff. Absolutely great stuff, and I know what I'm about 110 hours into this game now. I think. In fact, we can actually see that if we go to the character screen. I think we can see how long we've been playing here. Player stats. I've been personally playing for four days, which is what 24, 48, 96 hours, 23 hours. That's another uh, 120, 119, 119 hours. I've been playing this game. And am I anywhere near ball yet? Am I? Am I hell as like? I could have, I could have sworn there, but am I hell as like bored with this game? And apparently, I'm not even into Act Two yet. <laughs> I've been doing so many side quests, and I'm obviously playing this game in a very completionist style. I want to get every undiscovered location I can. I want to do every side quest possible, and uh, yeah, that's obviously hindering me in terms of my pacing. But I, I hope you don't mind. Prayer be praised. Read the crumpled note. If I was just blundering through the main quest line, we'd have been far done by now. But would I have experienced the beauty of this game properly? All that it had to offer? No. Right, now where's this crumpled note? I've completely and utterly just uh, allowed it to get bogged in the rest of this stuff. Praise be to Freya, our great mother. They said the road was fraught with danger, that sea devils awaited any who travelled it, that a bandit lurked behind every tree. But I sacrificed a lamb to Freya and donned an amulet made of falcon feathers, and lo and behold, I traversed the entire isle without so much as drawing my sword, and did some damn fine trading along the way. Packed my chest so full of silver and other treasures that my back near snapped, setting it on the wagon. If everything goes as planned, I'll be home by tomorrow, around sunset. I owe the goddess mightily for the tender care she's taken of me. Tender care, you say? Looks like very tender loving care to me. Right, find the treasure. God knows how we know where it is, because it doesn't make any mention of the treasure in our... in our... in, 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 the, in the note. But, uh, I assume it's a witcher thing. Yeah, it's actually quite far away. Why on earth would the treasure chest be over here, but his body be over there? I have no clue. Back and forth, back and forth, like a damn blummin... Uh, oh, what? It's taking me to a fast travel point. Why is it taking me to a fast travel point? Freya be praised. Is it on a different island? Can't be, can it? Why are you taking me to a fast travel point? Okay, I'm confused. I'm co just bear with me. Freya be praised.
Right, there were some there were some uh, drowners near to his body, so I wonder if uh, the chest the chest must be near where he is. It can't be all the way over here. I don't know why the quest marker is taking me to a fast travel point like it's wanting us to go to a different location, but. There's treasure to be had, I will find it. Trust me guys. <laughs> I will find it. Right. So there's no sign of it here. I wanna go down here. Oh we luck. Damn you! Happen to uh, come across a treasure chest, have you guys? Could it be in the water? Love it. Yes, there it is. Gold pearl necklace, a gold casket, a melitale figurine, and a sword. Not too bad a haul, really. Not too bad a haul, if I do say so. The hell is that thing? Whoa, I think it's a snow bear or something. I'll leave it be. Right, let's keep moving. Uh, there is another undiscovered location here, across the river, across the lake. Confused, where am I? Oops! Oh, come on! Oh my god, what the hell have I just stumbled into? Whoa, 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 whoa! Just chill out! Ah! Damn it! Okay, you're gonna really feel my wrath! You son of a bitch! Look at them all, my goodness me! Ah, anyone for some marshmallows? Bless and reward you, Witcher. So I can give you only a moment. Come by me home. It's not far. All right. I could use a herbalist also. So I'll sure as hell follow you now. What's up here? No, I don't want to lose him. Oh, this could well be his home. Bless and reward you, Witcher. So I can give you only a moment. Come by me home. It's not far. 
Well, stop picking herbs then. And go home, will you? <laughs> What's he doing? I think this is his home, to be quite honest with you. I mean, there is a building here, isn't there? Could be. But he's not interested in talking to me, so uh, we'll leave him be. We, uh, if we can remember where it is, we could return later. I'm not overly concerned about a reward. Did it out of the goodness of our hearts, you know? Because we're kind like that. Um, Alrighty, home. So there's one more undiscovered location here, and there is the quest as well, which we'll put on our. Uh, put the marker down. In fact, how do we get there? Is there mountains in the way? Yeah, we're going to have to go north and then round. Follow the road. Alright. Come on, Roach, we've got a bit of a journey ahead of us. Alright, off we go. Watch out! Whoa, whoa, that was close. Look at that stamina. How slow. Because oh, we're on the road, isn't it? <laughs> I was going to say how slow it's going down. I believe we're here. Now, what is this place? Whatever it is, it's in a state of disrepair. Hidden treasure. Is that a bear? Oh my god. Inheritance. Read the letter. Okay, if you insist. Jan! As I write these words, you are six years old. I am thirty. I am in my prime, but I know already I'll never teach you how to shoot a bow, nor how to ride a horse or care for a sword. I'll never take you on a raid, nor out fishing. I took a wound to my knee. Those blasted arrows, I'm telling you. During the last raid, it's taken a turn for the worse. Shouldn't have taken more than a few days to heal over, but something got in my blood. Wounds full of pus. Stinks. I'm losing feeling. The druids say it's beyond their help. And that I'll bleed to death if they cut off my leg. So I'm preparing for death. You're in for some tough years, lad. Our family's got a great many enemies. I've defended you against them, but now you'll be on your own. Perhaps someone will help you, and perhaps not. That's why I've had part of our goods hidden in old Ula's house, under the floorboards. That way no one can take it from you. No one can steal it, and you can dig it up once you've all grown. I've asked your mother to give you this letter when you start your 18th spring. You take that silver, son. Buy yourself a fine blade, some armour, a horse. Raid the continent. Exact revenge on the men who did you wrong after my death. Make me proud. I never told you this, but I've always felt it. I love you, Jan. I hope one day we'll meet in the halls of Frey's eternal green garden and you'll tell me about your life. The life I was not able to see. You have my blessing, son. Oh, and the music as well. So appropriate. So appropriately grim. Now, I would almost feel bad taking this treasure under the floorboards because, well, it's for his son, but his son never got the letter and we don't know who Jan is. If we had a choice to give it to Jan, I'd do it. But, well, 
I don't think we do. Box home. I'm intrigued as to what this place is or was. A thriving village serving nearby fortress Kaer Nysen. Today nothing remains of this past glory but a pile of stones, some debris and fading memories. What happened to it? What happened? So the nearby fortress is up there. And that is where we need to be for the quest for the missing sun. So we're going to manoeuvre ourselves across this here river. Absolutely sublime. Sublime scenery again. Now what on earth can possibly be in the ruins of an abandoned fortress? I think we're going to find out very, very shortly. I'm in the castle ruins using your witcher's senses. I'm doing it, but I'm not finding anything of note. Maybe it's not underneath. Maybe it's outside. Oh, what's that? The fiend. A fiend? Oh, okay. Uh -oh. Well, there's a missing son. Oh, my God. Get the bloody white sign on as far as fiends go he looks pretty cool he looks like a zebra but he's got like a red eye in the middle like a cyclops maybe a cyclops mated with a zebra oh my <gasps> Yeah, he could have finished me off right there. You're lost, pal. Hypnotised. Huh? 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 Enough to its lair to lick its wounds. Need to track it down. Well, I know where its lair is. It's downstairs. Need only the entrails. Fussy. Thought we had him there. Hypnotizers and ran off. Nice trick. <clears throat> Fang and claw wounds all over the body, but those indicate feeding. He died from a blow to the head. No Ove here. Maybe the fiend dragged him off. Oh, well, we should know where the, the lair is. We went downstairs in the in the keep before we came up here. So we're going to go down there now and finish that beast off if we aren't stuck. Which I believe we are. <laughs> You're joking, aren't you? Have I just found a way to get myself stuck? 
Oh no, seriously, please, no. No. Yeah. I've managed to get myself well and truly stuck. It's the first time this has happened in the game. Oh, I'm out! Whoa. Oh my god, that was close. That was close. How do I... How do I... How do I... <laughs> I'm completely and utterly uh, lost my bearings here. I will get them back in a brief moment. There we are. Mr. Fiend, ding ding round blooming two. Or is it? Is there? It's definitely, it should be here, shouldn't it? Find the fiend's lair using your Witcher senses. Huh? I could have sworn it was here. Maybe not. Oh, that has me stumped. Um, that has me royally stumped. Now what do I do? Ooh. There's my witch senses up here. Oh, here we are. What's this? Ran this way. Oh. Down here. Down here. And across here. Okay, so uh, his lair isn't anywhere near the keep at all. to the other side. Did he? I wonder if that's what killed the bear. Ah! Oh. There he is. Ding ding! Round two! Won't get away this time. Oh man, I'm gonna stay away from his horns. Time to end this. Hitting the tide, I have no idea what it does. Quite blindness, isn't it? Oof. No, 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 don't you run away from me, boy. Ah.
Search the fiend's lair for the missing son. There's a body over there. Looks like it's cut in half. Oh my god. Yellow tunic. Must be Ove. Avenged those boys. There's that at least. So, uh, collect our reward from whoever the quest giver was. I can't remember. It was so long ago now. Oh, he's in. Oh, Ran. Ran vague. Right, right, I see. I do see. Okay. Um. Do you know what? I think we're going to call it close to the session after this quest. What I want to do is I'm going to go here to the undiscovered location, and then into Ran vague. Tell the poor chap that his son is dead, but we've avenged him by slaying the beast that ate him. <laughs> uh, and then we'll call a close. Yeah, I didn't get anywhere near where I wanted to, but you know what? That's the nature of the beast. I've certainly had fun. And as per usual, yeah, we got distracted, which, uh, which is a good thing. We've, we've Picked up a couple of quests, done some extra stuff, had a parlay with a cave troll, had another run in with a village elder. All in all, not bad day's work. Bandit camp. Don't you just love bandits? How long are you gonna make me oh wait? Oh my gilly gosh. Really? You're gonna anger me by lobbing arrows at me? Not wise. Might as well loot whatever's here to be looted. Oh, there's a fisherman here. I didn't see him. Where'd he come from? Almost like one of those abandoned uh, sites that you liberate, you know? But not quite big. Not quite as big as uh, the real deal. Take the shortcut. Greetings. Any tidings? Bad ones. Your son's dead, killed by a fiend. All I could do was avenge him. I told him, son, nothing good ever came out of Pharaoh. Stay home. Your time will yet come for adventures and glory. Your reward. This gold brought me no luck. May it serve you better. And there we are. Two hundred and four crowns, not bad at all. Poor fella. Such is life. Such is life, and it's a very harsh life in The Witcher, isn't it? Very harsh indeed. Anyway, we're going to end the session there. In the next one, I will, hopefully, <laughs> begin to make my way further south on the island. Stopping off at a undiscovered location here, here, maybe pop off to this place here, see what that's all about. Meander down here, 
And then Onstein's point. Notice board. Re return a horn. See what other quests pop up in and around the vicinity. And then we move down from here to uh, the very southern tip of the island. Because down here, I believe there is a piece of the enhanced armor set for the Griffin School. So we'll go down there. Then we will fast travel. Oh, in fact, by the time we get down here, there's no fast travel. We might actually just go on foot. We'll, we'll make our way somehow across to the grotto where there is another piece of the enhanced Griffin armor set. And there is now the quest for the brothers. So we'll do that as well. Then after that, we'll make our way back north. The last two locations for Gremist's quest are in and around here somewhere. Get those done. And then we'll hand them into Gremist and uh, have a game of Gwent with him. And that, all of that, might just take another session. Of course, distractions on the way, more than likely. But that's the plan, at least, anyway. And then after we've done all of that next session, we will then be ready to... to, to to uh, advance the main quest line once again. So, uh, yeah, fun times in store. Still plenty to do in this game. I mean, the undiscovered locations in this area alone are just numerous. Am I going to get them all? I, I, ah, part of me says, yeah, I want to get every last one, but am I realistically going to get every single one? I don't, no, I don't think so. I really don't. But we'll just kind of get them as, as, as organically as we can en route to other quests and things like that. Maybe spend a session just sailing in the ocean, getting a few. Maybe do something that session slightly different, perhaps, than, than normal. But, yeah, plenty to keep us busy. And, uh, uh, you know, the game is absolutely great. So, uh, hopefully you'll join me next time for more witching. See you soon.